In this video, we're going to write the name for TiO2. There are two accepted names for TiO2, so let's look at both of them. So first, for Ti, let's write titanium. Then for the O here, let's write oxygen, and then replace the YGEN with IDE. So far, we have titanium oxide. Titanium and oxygen, the difference in electronegativity is 1.9. So it's very close to being ionic. There's a lot of covalent character here. So often to show that, we'll call it titanium dioxide. And this is probably the more common name that you'll see, titanium dioxide for TiO2. Another name that's accepted, instead of having dioxide, we have titanium 4 oxide. In this case, we're doing this because of the large amount of ionic character, and we have a metal in a nonmetal, which we often think about being ionic. So this is writing the name as an ionic compound. The four, that's because titanium, that's a transition metal. Oxygen's two minus, so we have this four plus here, and that's what we're showing in this name here for TiO2, titanium four oxide. And we need this because we didn't put di in front of the oxide, since titanium can have different oxidation states here, we need to indicate how many oxygens we'll have to balance the charge or the oxidation state here on the titanium. So these are the two accepted names for TiO2. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.